Hi there guys, Joe the Pet here, and today I am, I know I always look around in these videos, uh, but today I'm at uh, GameStop because, well I'm sitting right outside GameStop because it's freaking cold outside, it's like 40 something degrees. So, uh, today, um, Skylanders Scorpion Triple Pack uh, comes out, and I am going up there just to make sure that, I don't know where the camera is on the stupid thing, where is it? I don't, it's, it's there, I think. It's there? Are you there? Yeah, see you. Okay. So, uh, anyways, it comes out today, and it's got Hot Dog in it, and two other characters I don't care about. I think, actually, one of them I don't have, so I guess I kind of care about that, but Hot Dog's a big deal. Everybody is asking about, Hot Dog, Hot Dog, he's so cute, his little puppy dog, and it all red, and just fire, and brimstone, and I want him! So, uh. I am going to go pick him up. I actually reserved two of them, and um, I got one for me and one for my friend. If he's not able to get one or isn't, uh, didn't think ahead to get one. But uh, worst case scenario, I've got an extra one that I can just bring back. But that'll probably make somebody else happy. So, um, anyways, I'm up here, and yesterday. I wanted to get more content out that I did, but I, w I got sucked in by this game I'm doing a review on called Funky Barn, and it's one of those, like, time management games where it seems like, oh, you know, I've been playing for, like, you know, an hour, it's been, like, three hours, like, oh, no, oh, no, you know, it's one of those, it's like, I just keep going and going and going and going. And um, I want to do a review on that, so that will probably be up later. I'm going to be playing a lot of uh, Skylanders today, uh, breaking in Hot Dog, and um, trying to get him leveled up all the way so I can do a do a kind of like overview of how his different uh, paths work and stuff like that, like I did for uh, uh, the freaking dragon. I can't think of his name, but. Um, I did that, and uh, I don't know if y'all ever saw that or not. I know some of y'all are new to my my channel, and I'm kind of I'm kind of toying with the idea of like going over to uh, going over to the Wii U version of Skylanders because Forbes magazine said that was like the best version as far as like uh, graphics wise, like uh, just a little bit better, like uh, like the uh, the detail on in the stupid you know, 1080p and stuff like that, so I think I might try that, I'm not sure, uh, would y'all, would y'all watch 1080p if I did 1080p for Skylanders? I know some of y'all are, like, you know, younger, so I don't even know if you have a computer that can do 1080p, but I do love 1080p because I'm a big video file, and I love, like, the crispness, and, you know, it just seems so much better. When I go 720p, and then I go back to uh, 1080p and back and forth. It's like, ooh, ah, ooh, ah, ah, ooh. It's kind of like that. But, uh, and also, man, I've been tripping out um, on CES 2013. Uh, this year's CES, man, they, they've been really pushing the 4K or UHD TV or UHD or whatever they want to call it. And if you're not familiar with it, basically it's 4,000 lines of resolution. So 1080p, you have 1,080 lines of resolution. But 4K or UHD TV is 4,000 lines of resolution. So four times as much as HD TV, like full HD. So that is crazy. And the thing about that right now is, yeah, that's great and all. But what's it going to do for me? I mean, it's basically like, ooh, ultra awesome, crisp picture. But what I want to see in these TVs that they're doing H UHD TV, they're doing, I want to see uh, 2.35. And if you don't know what that is, when you go and see a movie at the theater, there's, uh, there's scope and there's flat. And what that means is scope is like cinema scope. And back in the 1960s is when it came out or 1950s, early 60s, and what it is, whenever you see those black bars, even on your, like, 1080p TVs, that's why, because that was shot in either 2.35 or 2.45 to 1 aspect ratio, and most, uh, most, uh, TVs, uh, you're gonna, when you get 1.85 aspect ratio, you're gonna get teeny-weeny, like, little, uh, black lines on top and bottom, 
And that's what I'm talking about. Like with these big TVs, what they need to do is they need to make it wider. They need a, a better aspect ratio because there are people like me that want to see these movies as they're meant to be seen, as you see them in the theaters, you know? Like, detail is great and all, but if I'm not watching the, the, it's not fitting the whole screen, what's the use? You know? I mean, I can zoom in, and I guess that, that would be good, like, if you have higher detail, because you're losing less of the picture, but then, then you're, you're cropping the picture, and that's not the way the movie was meant to be seen, or otherwise it would have just filmed it in 1.85. But anyways, I'm just going off a on a tangent, and basically, like I said, I'm a video file. I love videos, and I love to see movies as they're meant to be seen. And I would love to have a TV like that. And I know it's a long way off, but as soon as they start doing that, the sooner that I can get it, you can get it, and you don't know what you're missing until you see it. Because, like, just imagine, I know most of y'all are too young to remember this, but I remember uh, I was born in 78. So I missed Star Wars at the theater, okay? And I didn't really watch it until I was a teenager. And all they had was VHS at the time. So I watched it over and over and countless times, you know, hundreds of times on VHS, and I remember back in 1997, they had uh, A New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. They had all three of those come back to theaters, special edition. And when I saw that, it was like, oh my god, what is going on over there? What's over there? Oh my, what is this? This is crazy! And that's what widescreen is. That's the way it was supposed to be seen, 2.35 to 1. And they have widescreen now, but it's not, it's not the same. You know, you're still missing a lot of picture, you know, that, that the black bars are filling up. I want no black bars. I'm sorry. Anyways, guys, um, I, I'm going to go and uh, sit outside and enjoy my kolaches. And those of y'all don't know, this is a kolache. Uh, this is a Texas thing. And I don't know if you can see it or not, but there's like, there's jalapenos in here. So it's jalapenos and like a smoked sausage and it wrapped up in a bakery bun. It's so awesome. Oh my God. So bad. But my mouth is watering just thinking about it in my mouth. That didn't sound right at all. Anyways, I, I'll talk to you later, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, leave me a comment below uh, what y'all want to see on Saturday. I think I'm going to be doing best free games of the day. If not, you will have free games for iOS hint, hint, even if it's not best for games of the day. Anyways, guys, th thanks for watching. Y'all have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Skizzle! Boom, boom!